I finally get a chance to open every single promo box in Crown Zenith. Yo guys, welcome to a very special video here where we have a chance to, well, my chance, we are opening every single Crown Zenith box, uh, promo box that has a promo card in it. There is a couple we are missing, but we'll talk about that reason why. But this is the first time I'm doing one of these videos because I don't normally collect uh, the Pokemon cards. I normally get the chance to open them for you guys, where we are going to open... I, I enjoy Crown Zenith, and if it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't be able to do this anyhow, so... Crown Zenith's been my favourite set of opening, so thank you everyone who lets me do these. As you know, I do streams and everything like that. This is probably going to be a two-part video because we have so much to open. But first of all, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you what I've collected so far in my Crown Zenith little book. Lit, uh, so what we'll do is let me zoom out of the camera. Oh, yes. So, yeah, um, most of the normal stuff. We're missing one on this page. Most of these are common. We're missing four on this page. We're missing quite a few here. <laughs> but obviously, I have not opened too many. We've got a full one there, though. Beautiful. Uh, three on this page. But obviously, these are all the commons, uncommons. Unless you've got a few V-stars, there is a few missing, anything like that. Most of you will know about these ones. So as you can see, two missing there, two missing there. I mean, the commons and uncommons are very easy to get a hold of, even if you open a couple. I've opened, I think, a couple of tins and uh, one of the uh, ETBs for the first pack, the six there for the first box. Yeah, that one's uh, very empty, which is uh, not good. Uh, two there, two there, full set there. Obviously, these are all the, these are the trainers. Trainers are easy. One missing there, uh, there, and then we get into the. As you can see, this is one of the special secret rares or whatever you want to call them, secret energies, where they're the textured ones. As you can see, I've only got one. And there's one there as well, and then the secret rare Pikachu is the last of the normal set, and then we get into the uh, character res. So as you can see, I've got four on that one, only one on that page, three on that page, <laughs> zero. We got the Regigigas. That was out of the first ECB. I was buzzing about that. We got Guard of Gardena's Vigor. Uh, we got three on this page, which is actually really surprising. That uh, energy is just one of them. They don't have a number, so they're thrown in there at the end because Lucario's promo is there. Uh, and then we got Roxanne. So all the promos are going to go in this book. But that is what we've got so far in my Crown Zenith book. We are going to try and fill as much of this as possible. The first thing we're going to start off, obviously, uh, on the screen. As you can see, ETB. We're going to get in with the Crown Zenith ETB, which came out on the 20th of January. And it was uh, pr priced up at 49.50, which is, sorry, 49.95, which is the most common price, obviously, for an ETB. So we're going to get that open and then we'll get straight into it. Most of you will know what's in an ETB anyhow. Um, we'll go through it quickly. Um, just throw everything on the floor, which is great. Obviously, you get your 10 packs. Ugh, yas. 10 packs uh, of Crown Zenith. Your promo card, which I am going to do a giveaway for this because I already have this. All you've got to do, guys, is like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll do the giveaway for the second video. Uh, obviously, I'll put it in the comments below who wins this. So, good luck with that. And we got your sleeves. I, I, the only thing I don't like about the sleeves is they're not clear. That's the only issue. Um, then the rest of the stuff is uh, you got the sleeve dividers, a bulk load of that. Your QR code, if anyone's interested, I will now zoom that in so you can see it. The QR code, if anyone's interested, but no one is. And then you've got your dice and your counters, which no one cares about, <laughs> unless you actually play it. So let's get into the first pack of this video. I'm so looking forward to this. I'm hoping I'm getting, I'm, I'd, I'd just be happy just to take one gold card. I mean, obviously this is for my set, so. You never know, I forgot a bin which is about right. So let's go one, two, three, four. Pack number one from the ETB, let's go. Uh, so we got the V-Star card, which is rubbish. Uh, Rescue Carrier, Electric, Digging Duo, Cypher, Pokeball, Young Goose, Cherubi, Execute, Radiant Zard, which I already have, but that's a good condition one, which is good to see. It's a great start of a card. We'll get that in a sleeve. So there we go, Radiant Charizard, first pull. Definitely doing some swaps with that bad boy. And there's your QR code for that if you are interested. Right, pack number two of the ETB. Let's get into it. Oh my god. Um, 
I'm having a, I'm having a look at the prices now. It's kind of weird that there's um, the gold. There's there's four gold cards which most of you will know about, and um, at the moment the Mewtwo V Star is smack bang in the middle of the value of them. There is some lovely cards in this. Looking at them on the screen, but yeah, right. Slazzle Dazzle, Dusclop, Smetang, Yamma, Onyard, the Cricketer, Shinx. Oof, oof, oof. Awful pack. We don't want to see too many of them. We'd like some character, at least some character rares or something like that, please. Here we go, pack number three. Psychic, Ultra Ball, Crushing Hammer, Luxio, Seal, Rockruff, Aaron, Riolu, Starly, Absol, Reverse Hollow, not the greatest, and Zorora V Max again. I think that's a card I already have, even though it's not exactly quite a common card, but it is a cool card, which is good to see. We'll put that in a sleeve. That looks like I've got another swap card for that. Beautiful. That is your QR code for that pack, and let's get into pack number two. Yeah, um, after opening all the promo boxes, guys, if you have been opening the Crown Zenith, let me know what you've been thinking about these. Again, I think this is one of the best sets we've had in ages, and the, 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 I don't know how they're going to beat it. It's going to be very difficult to beat this type of set. I mean, the new set is different. The, the base set of Scotland Violet, oh my. Well, there we go, there's our first big boy pull. The Darkrai V-Star character rare alt art, which is worth about $18 at the moment, raw. And behind it is a Snorlax. Hmm. Yeah, so it's worth about $18 raw, which is a big dub because I do not have that card and that is going straight into the binder after this, which is superb. Four packs in, finally getting a big boy pull. That is one of the top uh, pulls of this. There's your QR code. Uh, in the top 10, is that? No, uh, top 15. Lovely jubbly. Lovely jubbly. Most of the car it's all the character rares that are in the top 15, bar the Pikachu. Uh, the Pikachu secret rare, which is the last of the top 15. Uh, which is not too bad. I mean, there is some good pulls in this, so yeah. The ETB um, seems to be getting a little bit scarce at the moment while doing this, recording this video, which is in May now, obviously, since we've had to wait for the last set of uh, promo cards coming out. Shinx, Corfish, Pawniard. We got a Mew character rare. Again, I think that's a card I already do have. And behind it is an Agron Hollow, which actually I don't think I have, which is actually a good thing. Um, so yeah, I'll put that there. We'll get the Mew into a sleeve as well. I like that Mew character rare. I think that is a, such a good looking card, which is good to see. Uh, we'll stick that over there. Obviously, I'll show you all the best pulls from this ETB. We're doing quite well at the moment, so that is good to see. There is your QR code for that one. Right, let's get into the next one. Yeah, well, there's, a, there's a lot of promo boxes, a lot of promo packs. There's a lot of promo everything. Obviously, a, this is classed as a holiday set, so, you know, um, you're having a giraffe rig. Um, the holiday sets are always more expensive, but you can pick up some special offers. I've been able to do that anyhow. Ugh. Oh, Regigigas V, which I actually don't think I have. <laughs> um, Young Goose Reverse Hollow as well. I mean, I'll put, the, I'll put the Reverse Hollows in my set if I need them. Uh, or I might just, if I already have them, because obviously some people actually want the normal and the reverse hollows as a full set. They, they class that as the ultimate set collection, but it don't bother me too much because most of them are common and uncommons, I think. I actually don't even know if you can actually get reverse hollow for every single card as common and uncommon. That'd be quite surprising if someone does know that. Let me know in the comments below. Right. Friends in History, Carvanine, Lost Vacuum, Switch, Snow Run, La Vesta, Tangela, Baltoy, Reverse, and drag all these nuts across the floor because that is a non hollow. Ah, uh, dear, dear, dear. Right. QR code for that one. We are smashing through this ETB. This is the biggest. This will be the biggest. Um, pro, this, the ETB is technically the biggest promo of this video because the big ones at the end. Uh, obviously are the Zashian and Zamazenta, but they're because we're going in order. Uh, one, two, three, four. We're going, we're going to go in order of this, so yeah, of each pack being, well, each promo card being dropped, promo pack being dropped, we'll get it right eventually. Riolu, a Crocroak, and a Scizor. Not doing that well here at the moment. Oof. We started off quite well with this ETB, but that's two stinky packs in a row. Come on, two more packs left of this ETB. Right, come on, please, we need something good here. I want, I'm hoping to get at least one gold card, please. Trekking Shoe Shaman, or the Mewtwo. That is a, such a beautiful card. Wooloo, Pancham. 
Oh, we got trucks. His trucks. Tux, you should see the character rare. Again, a really good looking card. Behind it is a Lux Rare Non Hollow. Again, I'm not 100% sure if I had that card. I don't think I did. Obviously, you guys got to see what was in the in the binder at the time. There is your QR code for that one. Then we got Last Pat Magic on this one. Right, Last Pat Magic of the ETB, and we'll see what we get. Then we're going to jump onto the next promo boxes. Great ball, trekking shoes, Luxio, Baltoy, Meowth, Whale Mass, Shinx, Corfish, Zorora Reverse, and a Lycan Rotten non Hollow. Oof, not exactly the greatest way to finish that ETB off. Here is your QR code for the last pack there. So let's get, let's just show you what we've just pulled out of that. We pulled one of the top 15 bangers, which is good. So we got a Regigigas V, the Mew Character Rare, Agron Holographic, the Darkrai V Star, which is the big boy one, Toxtricity Character Rare, Zorora V Max, and of course, another Zard which is a cool card, the Radiant Charizard. You don't want the Charger Bug, so that's the best pulls out of that. So let's move on to the next box. So box number two came out at the same date, which was obviously the 20th of January, which was the first ones. We got the Reggie Drago collection box, which is four packs and obviously all the promos. I want the promo cards, the big promo card, and I want, I don't even know if anyone collects the big promo cards. If you do, let me know. Uh, these were retailed at 19.95. Of course, that's how much I paid for them because there was no special prices at this point in time. So let's get into this. So here you go, here's your four packs, which feel really loose. Okay then. We've had, I've had these for a while. We got the, uh, let me zoom that back in. We got the Reggie Lecky promo, which of course I'm going to sleep because that is one of the promos I want. Actually good sensory on it and it doesn't look damaged, which is quite rare. <laughs> and then we obviously have the Reggie Drago V card. Another Black Star promo again. They're, they're all right. I mean, I want to collect them because obviously I want the full set. There's your QR code for this Reggie Drago set, whatever you want to, Reggie, yeah, Reggie Lecky, is it Reggie? Reggie Drago set, and there's your big card. I mean, I'm not going to zoom out of that. There you go. Again, I don't even know who collects the big cards. If any of you do, please let me know. I don't mind giving it you. Know, so, yeah. Right, let's get into these four packs. Only four packs in this, but obviously it was a much cheaper promo box. It's actually still good value because the packs were still at five quid a pack, um, which is about the average price. There's a damage card in there, but at least it's not the rare one. Right, here we go. Crushing Hammer, Friends in History, Shaman, Seal, Rockruff, Aeron, Riolu, Starly, a Reverse Hollow Shaman, and a Luxray Non Hollow. That is not the way you want to start. Yeah, um, these, the Reggie Lecky and the Reggie Drago promos are very common. You can still get a hold of these, which is about right. These are very loose, these packs, compared to the uh, ECB. Again, it's, it, it just seemed every pack was different. I mean, every pack seal, like every promo was sealed differently. Must have been in every different one, but yeah. Right, Matang, Shaman, Hisui, Baltoy, Meowth, Whaleman, Shinx, Corfish, a Reverse Hollow Larvesta, and a Gumshoes Non Hollow. I can see why people don't like these promo boxes the way we're going. We're getting absolutely nothing here. QR code for that one. Two more packs left. We just need one good pull from this. Just one. One good pull would be good enough. Right, here we go. Right, Salazzle Dazzle, Rare Candy, Dusclops, Cypher, Pokeball, Young. Uh, Young Goose, Cherubi, Execute, Corfish Reverse, and a Yam Mega. Oh my days, we are massively in the mud. So we've had not even one special card in this promo box, which is actually, which is actually really, really bad. And we got Last Pat Magic on this, and well, I'm not looking forward to this. I can't even get into the pack properly. Some of these packs were done. So all we need is one pull. One, like one semi, we don't need, just a character rare. Otherwise, this was the biggest L promo box going. I mean, as again, I can see why people are not really a fan of these Reggie Dragon Reggie Leckies with the way they're dropping stuff. Digging Duo, Ultra Ball, Love Disc, Immogla, Yamma, Come On, Pawniard, Cricketar. Wow. Oh, wow. That, so that is your Reggie Drago box. We've got a Reggie Lecky next. I can't wait. Right, so after the first Reggie Drago one, we've now got the Reggie Lecky. I'm, I'm absolutely dreading it. Absolutely dreading it. There's your overgrown size card if anyone's interested again, I don't know. Four packs of probably nothing because we've already seen what we've got out of them. Then we've got the Reggie Drago Hollow promo card. The Reggie Lecky V promo card. 
which is literally all we're getting out of these, it seems like, in these boxes. So, yeah, can't wait. QR code if anyone else wants that. And now we get into the four packs of Doom. If we get anything out of this, I'll be very, very surprised. We've had one decent pull so far in this video, and it's not great. Energy Switch, Crocker Oak, Ultra Ball, Love Disc, Chatter, Yamma, Porniard, Bidoof, Caldio, let's go. It's actually something, one of my favorite uh, character red cards, actually. It's such a beautiful card, even though it's nothing special, and it looks right, but it's actually a promo card. I mean, it's actually a card we actually need, I think. Me think. Me think, me think, I'm not 100% sure. QR code for that one. Here we go, pack number two. Are we going to continue with the pulls? Dark Energy, by Sharp, Digging Duo, please. Ultra Ball, Bidoof. Salandit, Purloin. Grubbin, Scralp. Yes, we got the Hiswain, Voltorb. Hiswain? Yeah, I'm probably going to go like that. And it's. Oh, a Kyogre Holographic. We'll take that. I don't think I need it, but we'll take it. Obviously, at the end of the videos, uh, obviously, there's definitely going to be a part two for this. We will put all these into our binder and see how many cards, unfortunately, we need, which hopefully is not every single gold card because they're about, well, the top one's about $100, the lowest one's about $40, so, yeah, and like, considering how much we've spent, they're not the hardest to pull. If you've watched any of my streams, you'll know that we have pulled quite a few of them, so fingers crossed. Luxio, Salandi, Energy Search, Grubbin, these nuts, Scralp, Wooloo, Gardena's Vigor. Uh, it's a good pull, but I already have it, which is a, god damn it. It's actually, that's actually a really nice centering on that one as well. I do like that card. And behind it is a Hilulisk. Um, yeah, another swap card, which is cool. But at least this says, at least this is actually giving us pulls compared to the first box. Uh, so they're not as bad as we thought, so which is good. And then we finish off with the last pack, which I thought I was not going to be able to open. So we've only had one pull so far from the top 15 pulls, which is still better than nothing. The Garden Vigor is just a little bit cheaper than that. It's on it's in the top 20, so Lost Vacuum, Luxio, Digging Jewel, Potion, Fraud, Sunkern, Coffin, a dish, Gumshoes, Reverse, and a Whale Lord. No, not low. We love the Whale Lord, it's everywhere, isn't it? So that is your promos for the Reggie Lecky and Reggie Drago, which come out of the same as ETB. Um Massive risk in them ones, but yeah. Next we get into, let me zoom out of that one. Next we get into the Pikachu VMAX, which I've I've been waiting to open this one. This is one of my favorite out of the promo collections. Uh, the Pikachu VMAX, VMAX. I don't know why I keep saying VMAX. Uh, the VMAX, which come out on the 17th of February, uh, and it was valued at 29.95, so 30 pound. Um, obviously a bit more expensive than the normal, because you only get five packs. Of course, it's made it more expensive, but you do get these promo cards. So let me smash this open, you'll get to see what we get. So you get five packs, lovely jubbly, which is good. And then, uh, do you know what? With the oversized ones, this is probably one of the best oversized cards you get. It's the Pikachu V Max oversized card. Um, again, if anyone interested in the big cards, let me know in the comments below. Obviously, I can do the giveaway with the, Lu uh, the Lucario. I almost said Lucio, uh, the Lucario. And now let's get into the actual promo part cards. So promo card number one is the Chunkachu V Max. Not a rainbow rare, but it's a different variant to the one. If obviously, if you guys open Vivid Voltage, you'll know exactly what I'm on about. But yeah. Again, probably the best promo, one of the best promo cards that you can get. And then the Pikachu V, which the centering is not that great on it, but for a promo card, it's not the worst condition because you know what promo cards are like. Um, they're a bit stinky. Uh, and there's your QR code for that, that uh, box, the promo box, if you're interested in that. Now, let's get into the five packs, which hopefully will be decent considering it's at the Pikachu box. I haven't really seen many people open the Pikachu box, so you never know. There might be some good stuff in it. We've got a V-Star card, which is yay. No one's interested in, but you know. Red Candy, Riolu, Starly, Cypher, Pokeball, Young Goose, Reverse Holo, Kyogre, which I don't need. And the Absol Holographic, which I think is my favorite holo, just because obviously the, the holographic pops out of the card as well, as you can see, out of the borders, and it's in the... Uh, I don't know what to call that, but that's actually pretty cool. 
um, but not the greatest start to this. But yeah, obviously these packs are more expensive because you only get five, but you want the promo cards. But we've got another one that's definitely massively overpriced, which is not great, but you had to do it to get the promo. But, you know, so it is, isn't it? Right, Water, Shaman, Friends in History, Carvanine, Riolu, Aaron, Starly, Cypher, Imogla, we got a Pucciana character rare, double banger behind it, no, another Luxray. But you know, a Pucciana is a good pull. I definitely don't have Pucciana, which is good to see. There we go, lovely jubbly. A QR code for that one. Still only had one of the big pulls, which is surprising, considering how many we've been into. Pack number three of the Pikachu promo. Right, Psychic, Bisharp, Gravlack, Pokemon Catcher, Cypher, Imogla, Young Goose, Cherubi, Execute, Mew, again, character rare. Very surprised, you'd think this one is quite a rare one, but it isn't. And we've got Nessa uh, the Nessa signed holographic. I'm not sure if I need that. You can get reverse hollows in them cards, but it, technically that's a double banger. You can get reverse hollows in them, but you want the holographics in them signed cards. They're not as common as you think think um, but I'm not 100% sure if I need that one but again we'll find out in the second video of this uh, right sec uh, second to last pack all of these packs have been sealed woefully just about get into them one two three four we're still waiting for one of the gold cards or one of the top five balls which is basically all the golds and Mewtwo which is a cool card we've pulled that before on stream Cypher, Pokeball, Cherubi one of them None, it doesn't matter what they are because they don't actually need them because they're not actually numbered. But you know, um, is there any print lines on this? <gasps> I don't think there's print lines. Oh my God. Have we pulled a card with no print lines? So if you've opened any crowns or anything, you pull one of them energies, then just basic reverse energies. You'll know the print lines are the worst thing possible in that thing. So I've always said, if you pull one of them with no print lines, you might actually get, a, if you can get it graded, you might actually be worth something. My, I don't think they are, but, because like almost every single one has had a print line on, which is poop. Right, last pack magic of the Pikachu uh, V-Box. Please, show us something good. Lunatone, Soul Rock, Sunkern, Coffin, Oddish, Solandit, Energy Search, Shatter, and a double. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. So that Pikachu promo box was a bit stinky, which is about right. Not looking forward to that. Oh dear. Right, let's get into the next promos, which are. The mini tin, well they're not mini tins, actually technically the mini tins did come out at the same time. So we had the mini tins come out which I was not interested in because obviously they didn't have any promo cards in them and they were £10 each which is bang average at these. But then we get the bird tins, so we had the big version and the little version one. So we had the four pack tins which I've got and the five pack tins. Uh, the four pack tins were obviously 20 quid each and the five packs were 25 quid each. So um, I went for the mini tins because I just want the promos but obviously we get four packs in each. I didn't... I, don't have loads of money. So we'll get into them and I'll show you each of the pro. I'll open all three of them and then we'll uh, I'll show you all of the promos for these, but most of you have probably seen them. So there we go, 12 packs to open from these promos. And then we get into each promo card, which I will zoom in so you guys can see. Uh, we start off with the, uh, the Articuna promo, which is cool. Uh, QR code for that one. Then we got the Zapdos promo. And the QR code for that one. And the Glarian Moltres promo. I, I, I like all three of them, but let me know in the comments below which one you think is the best out of the three bird promos. And then the QR code. Right, let's get into these 12 packs, starting off with pack number one. Um, the bird tins, when we opened them, they were pretty decent. Uh, I can't get into this pack, so... Yeah, they were pretty. They were pretty decent. The pulls were pretty good. Um, you can get good de deals on the promo on these as well because you can buy them in threes, and there was some deals on them. I don't know if they're still available because they were. They did come out the 17th of Feb, so it's been a couple of months since these have been out. So I'm just hoping we get something decent. That just skip one Rockruff, Tangela, Shinx. Not a great start, but Sanshin V. That's not too bad. I definitely do not have this card if I remember right. 
any of the V cards is helpful. I don't think I have loads of them. So, QR code for that one. Right, pack number two. Ultra Ball, Friends in History, Last Vacuum, Shinx, Pancham, Snow Run, Fournia, Vangler, No, Energy Switch Reverse. Um, we don't talk about that pack. That pack was probably one of the worst we've ever seen. Any of QR code for that one. Oh, oh I can actually open this one with these. I've not been able to open them easy. Right. Dark Energy, Salazzle Dazzle, Dusclops, Matang, Purloin, Grubbin, Skrull, Pellet of Pile, please. Oh, we got Thweevil, Wooloo, Thweevil! I don't think I've got this card. And a Volcanion Holographic. I definitely do not have this card. It's actually quite a rare card to pull, which is very surprising. I mean, certain Holographic cards are really awkward to get a hold of in this set. It wouldn't be worth loads, obviously, if I had to buy it, but, you know, every pull is helpful. Weevil, thank you very much. Oh dear. Still none. We've had one of the big five pulls, which is very surprising. So last pack of the first tin. Technically, obviously we've opened all three of them, but yeah. Uh, we'll start with Leaf Me Alone. Uh, you're having a Giraffe Rig, Energy Switch, Crocker Oak, Purloin, Grubbin, Scralp, Headless of Pile, Wooloo. Pinchurch in reverse and another Snorlax. Oh, jeez. We are not doing well in these tins, are we? So we had, yeah, nothing too mad. Right, next tin. Let's go straight into it again. The pack has been awfully sealed together. All right, Steel, Rescue Carrier, Slazzle Dazzle, Carvanine, Aron, Corefish, Energy Search, Zypher, Riolu, no, come on, Reverse Sanction. And an Executor, oh my god, oh my god, we are not doing well in these, I'm going to be spending an arm leg to do complete this blooming promo set, because uh, the way it's going, as I said, the top five cards combined is going to cost me over £200, let's go, one, two, three, four, oh dear, right, steal. Dusclops, Trekking Shoes, Larion, Oddish, Slandy, Energy Search, Grubbin, Wooloo, Bidoof, Reverse, and a Luxray non hollow. Is it is this is this how it's gonna be? This is how it's gonna be, and it we've this is this is awful. This this is we're falling apart. I think I've given up already. I, I, there's me opening my mouth saying, Yeah, these tins have been pretty decent at pulls. And then it's just falling apart in front of me, which is about right. Energy switch, Crocker Oak, Lunatone, Sunkern, Coffin, Bidoof, Salandit, Purloin. Looks very reverse. And a Tangrove Holographic. Mm, I'm not angry. I'm not angry. I'm not angry at all. QR code. Oh my god. Right, last one of the second team. Uh, we are just getting... We're just getting laughed at by Pokemon. We are just getting absolutely laughed at. I, again, I didn't think the pulls would be this scarce, considering what we pull on stream. But, you know, right, Sinnoh, Gloom, Ultra Ball, I give up, Ball Toy, Meowth, Whale Shinx, please. No, Scrout Reverse, and another Luxray. Ray. Oh, dear, oh, dear. I think I'm sick of seeing Lux Rays. Oh my days. Well, that tin was absolutely terrible. Not one pull. A full tin, £20, not one pull. You wouldn't even make a fiver back, and even if you sold the reverse hollows and the rares in the bulk, you wouldn't even make a fiver. Up there with one. I can't, I can't get into this one. Up there with the worst pulls I've ever seen. Right, last tin. Let's go. Electric, Digging Duo, Giraffe Rig, Aaron, Energy Search, Cypher, Riolu, Young Goose, a Snorlax, Reverse, and Enormous. It, technically, that's the first pull we've seen of that, but I know I already have that because it's common as anything. QR code. Is this going to be another tin of bugger all? I'm going to say yes. Second pack of the last tin. Gravelab, Pokemon Catcher, Salazzle, Immobile. It started off so well with the ETB, getting good pulls, and now we've just fallen apart. Riolu, which I think we've already pulled. And a sign, that's a that's a hollow signed Rayhan, which is actually a good. Our class is a good pull. 
Oh, because we've had absolutely nothing. I think we already have Riolu. I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, I think we do. Fingy for there, I can't. I've just I've the QR code. We've fallen apart again. Two packs left. We're, we're not pulling anything fantastic. Two packs left of this video because this video has already gone through quite a lot of cards. Again, another pack that just doesn't want to open. Does that mean there's something good in here? Probably not. Come on, Lightning Energy. Let's go. Carbonine, Rescue Carrier, Larion, Meowth, Whale Mat, Shinx, La Vesta, Oddish, no, Reverse Holo Vacuum, and a Pangoro Non Holo. Oh my days. QR code. Last pack magic of the video, because obviously, if you guys want to see part two, which will be out. Not straight away. Part two will definitely be out, but it won't be straight away. I'll give it a, get a little bit of a gap between part one and part two. But if you want to see, I'll, pro I'll put part two obviously in the link below, but it'll be in the same on my Pokemon playlist anyhow, where it's Pokemon open and everything like that. But, well, we've st we've had an absolute hell of a pack. I have a I Volcanium Reverse and a Tauros. Oh, my days. Oh, oh I... I've just, uh, so, apart from the ETB, the rest has been woeful. The tins, do not go near the little tins, uh, the, like the, the bird tins if you're going to do them, just go for the big tins, it seems like the big tins had bigger pulls in them. Um, obviously if you guys want to see me, obviously, uh, well, tune in for obviously video part two where we go through the next set of stuff um, and obviously, oh, QR code if anyone is interested, I forgot about that one. If you guys want to see uh, what, how much we fill up, which is, yeah, not a lot, um, and continue hopefully maybe getting a gold, but I'm really not thinking about it. But yeah, thank you everybody for watching this video all the way through, you bunch of legends. Again, make sure you enter into that giveaway, like, comment below, uh, like, comment, and sub there we go uh, and obviously i'll do the giveaway if you want the big tip big cards as well let me know um but i'll see you guys for part two of this pack opening which hopefully fingers crossed is going to be much better but yeah thank you very much for watching see you guys in the next video stream take it easy obviously peace